Hey everybody, Heather from Hooked on Pickin' here. We have got a sweet unboxing for you. Because it's candy. We've got all sorts of different kinds of things. This is called Grandpa's Joe's Candy. And it's got a lot of fun things in it. And so we're going to be listing all of these items on HookedOnPickin.com. HookedOnPickin.com. And so you can go straight to the snacks and candy category, find all these things, and buy it up. And so uh, let's go ahead and unbox it and see what we got. This has just been the sweetest week, right? You got a whole pallet of candy on Tuesday. We sold some candy on Wednesday. And now you get this one. We just can't handle it. I ourselves. love candy. We love candy. You love candy. We all love candy. These are different kinds of candies, though. Yes, these are uh, really cool. Wait, peeps. It is becoming peeps. Easter, isn't it? Peeps. peeps. So this is from uh, one of our regular distributors that we use, or uh, people we get stuff from. So, this Ooh, is it's, all going to be brand new, It's an fresh assortment. Stuff. Peepies. Isn't that the classic peep? The yellow this, peep? The yellow peep. Yep. All right. Leave in the comment section below, are you a pro peep or an anti peep person? Because I think peeps are one of those controversial things, kind of like eggnog. You really? either love it or you hate it. Yes. It's, it's a whole controversy. Who doesn't love a peep? We'll find out in the comment section Bunch below. Bunch of fun haters don't love oh. peeps. <laughs> All right. Gotta love you some peeps, man. See, I'm a traditionalist. I only eat peeps around Easter, though. Can't oh. eat them any other time. If you eat them any other time, it's just wrong. Yep. It's double the calories. That's is what true. It is. Probably. Ooh, what is this? Hmm. Ooh. It's a Krabby Patty sucker. <laughs> oh, now we have It's to like bring, a shish kebab. It's a shish kebab. We have to bring one of these to Lexi and Faith. 100%. Yes, because they're scarred for life about Krabby Patty gummies. They are. They are. Yes. Because their brother brought them to the store one time. Yep. He wouldn't buy the little Krabby Patty yep. gummy for them. It was way back in the day when he first started driving. They were younger. <laughs> well, he also probably had no money. <laughs> That's true, too. Uh, so that was probably a legitimate reason. But uh, they were begging and begging and begging. Yep. And it scarred him for life. Like, they still talk about it. And it's probably yeah. been five years. Yeah. So, <laughs> so anyway, yeah. we need to bring one of those to the girls because I feel like that would make them feel better. <laughs> there you go. Right. So much want to grab these and just squish them, don't you? Do it. Oh, it didn't Do pop. It. See if you can get them to pop. Oh. There we go. That was a good explosion. What are these? Dill pickle lollipop. Oh, yeah, they are. Because it's that's a, a it's thing. It's a pickle lollipop, Heather. Does it taste like pickle? It you says know? naturally flavored. Naturally flavored? They, like they dip it in a pickle Vinegar. jar. <laughs> <laughs> they just dip it in a pickle jar. Huh. Gotta have some pickle uh, Sometimes suckers, man. Sometimes you just gotta have a dill Very important. Lollipop. They almost look like feathers there for a moment, you know? They almost look yeah. like feathers. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We saw this at Ripley's Believe It or Not, and I found them. You've been looking ever since. I know, where you can actually buy crickets. Apparently, they are edible. The wacky and weird, that's what the we The wacky sell. and weird, man. So we've got different flavors. Of course. Because sour cream and onion <laughs> crickets. Come on, just t just zoom in real tight That's, on that. Just you know, if you're tight. if you were teaching like on uh, John the Baptist, that'd be good too. You know, doesn't that just Lo look so yummy? That's probably the closest to Lokes and Wild Honey. I did that. Uh, oh my goodness, years ago I did that. Oh, here's bacon and cheese. Bacon and cheese. We, we need to give one of those to Adam. He would totally eat it. He that ate kid, one uh, in my sermon illustration yeah, years and ago. Here is salt and vinegar. If you just want traditional, here's salt and yep. vinegar. Yep. But if you're ever teaching on John the Baptist, he ate locust and wild honey. Yes. So, there you go. Okay. Closest you're going to get to a locust is a cricket. That's weird. Shannon, you'd eat a cricket, wouldn't you? Look. Caitlin, for this video, would you eat a cricket? Probably not. <laughs> oh, come on. Come Caitlin, on, Caitlin. Oh. I'm with Caitlin. I, yeah, I am with Caitlin. 
<laughs> Here we go. We sell this pretty quick, too. We do. This is amazing tasting. Good old coffee candy. Yep. Would it's you try, Caitlin, would you try coffee candy? Are you coffee candy? Coffee candy? Yeah. yeah. Okay, she'll yeah. try coffee yes. candy eventually. Right. There we go. That stuff's good. Then it looks like we have espresso candy. Yes, espresso candy. We have coffee candy, espresso candy. Yeah, there's the espresso. Like this. You've had this before. Is it, is this it is decent? This is amazing. Yeah. Love it. I'm not a big coffee guy myself. Oh, your mom loves these. Yeah. The cow tails. Cow tails. These are kind of impulse, impulse aisle stuff. Most yeah. of this stuff is, yeah. When you're up at the checkouts, yeah, that's, those know, are like called crickets. the impulse styles. Crickets. Well, that's where you're going to find them probably, that's you true. know. Up this there. This is more espresso candy. They don't want you to really think about it a whole lot when you're buying crickets. <laughs> is that what it is? Yeah, I think so. Okay. And then coffee candy. More coffee candy. So we do sell that really fast. Yeah, we do. All right. I like the screaming chicken on the box. Screaming chicken. It's because they ate a cricket. Probably. Well, that makes sense. Chickens eat crickets, don't they? I don't know. What do they eat bugs. Eat? They eat bugs, don't they? I don't know. What do chickens eat? I'm pretty sure it's bugs. Oh, what kind of Pez is it? It's Easter Pez. Easter Pez. Pez. So we've got a sitting bunny, a chick, a bunny, a lamb, and a floppy bunny. Oh, they have the lamb? Where's the lamb at? It says there's a lamb. Look. Isn't it cute? Aww. There you go. No cross pez though for Easter. Yeah. I wonder if they ever made that. They might have. Empty tomb pez. <laughs> it's empty. Well, you just call any pez dispenser. It's empty it? until you press the the you know the button for oh, the pez, God. then boom, you know that'd be cool. And then what would come out? Little little Jesus pezes come and out of the you empty would tomb. Eat them? You want Jesus inside of you, don't you? <laughs> Jesus in your heart. Terrible theology. <laughs> what? Terrible theology. Oh, look. Amy would be so happy right now. This is an entire box of Jelly Belly... Popcorn? Popcorn. What stuff. kind of... They is probably it in a container? Probably did some kind of specialty, I yeah, bet. let's see. Let's scooch this over. Sure. She, this is, her, this is uh, Amy's favorite flavor mm -hmm. of Jelly Belly, is the butter-flavored popcorn. What is your favorite Jelly Belly flavor? Leave it in the comment section below. My favorite Jelly Belly flavor is Jelly Belly. All of them? All of the above? Oh. Ooh. It's a little popcorn container. Oh, look at that. That's really cute. That'd be a, a nice little like party favor. That would be a nice party favor. Mm. I could eat some... Uh, Movie theater popcorn, I'll tell you that right this now. This is called Tongue Torches. They smell like Red Hots. Yeah, they're a fireball, yeah. basically. Tongue Torches. Tongue Torches. Yep. If you never want to taste anything again, ever. These are my favorite candy bar. Caramellos. Somebody okay. open it. Oh, well, there way. you go. They are good. Cadbury. Cadbury. Those are Cadbury, that's why. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize caramel is a Cadbury. Yeah. I wonder I like them so much. Did you buy Cadbury cream eggs? Because those are the best. I don't know if I could get those. Let's see. We have got, ooh, because baseball softball season starting it's we got coming up dill pickle jumble salted and roasted sunflower seeds yes we do it's a big pack too the pack. jumbo pack the jumbo Ooh, jelly bellies a 
lemon meringue pie. Nice. Any more boxes in there? Bubble gum. Nice. Look at those cotton candy peeps. Those are beautiful. They are beautiful. Ooh, more sunflower seeds. Same flavor as the dill pickle, uh, or? Let's see. This one says, "Ooh, no." Got to open them. Definitely got to open. Them. We got to see that packaging. This one is bacon mac and cheese. Yeah, it is. That's amazing. And this one is barbecue. Ooh, that that's probably fantastic. Yep. You would totally do the barbecue. Hundred percent, I would. Okay, so these are three boxes that they decided to save on shipping, and they taped them all together. So I have to tape them apart or cut them apart. These are the old-fashioned candies. We sell these pretty well. You can't get these everywhere. A lot of uh, mom-and-pop stores carry them, which is what we are. Uh, they don't let a lot of like Amazon sellers and yeah. box stores sell them. That's yeah, I don't think it. you can get them on Amazon. Uh, another couple of stacks in for their duplicated out. Just mention it. This one is sassafras. Sassafras. What's it taste like? Sassafras. Sassafras. It's kind of a root beer. Yeah, root beer orange is how, how I best describe it. Okay, what are these? Ooh, that's a different one. Right? Rasp. Berry. That's how you say it. I like raspberry. <laughs> pee is silent. Is it? Don't pee on your berries. <laughs> Ooh, lemon drops, my fave. That's what James digs. He's a sour guy. Yeah, he is a he sour He likes guy. sour candies. Alright, I'm going to look at these other ones. Same kinds. These are all different. Beautiful. Made in the USA. What? That's good. That's hard to find, man. A lot of the candies you find that actually, though. Yeah. I think the uh, imp locally. yeah the shipping and the imports and stuff and like the that. Yeah. Stuff. Yeah. That is incredibly strong. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Licorice. Licorice. Wild cherry. Yes. These are all hard keys. Yep. Watermelon. Beautiful. These are all good. If a uh, trick for you, if your throat is having some problems and you need some cough drops, I should know I've been coughing for like a hundred days. But uh, sometimes the cough drops will dry out your throat and then it's harder to talk and speak. These don't seem to do that as much. Now they're not coated with any medication. But they do keep your kind of your your throat a little bit more moist so that you can speak and whatnot, help with the coughing a little bit. So 
I want to try some of that. You just have to be a little more careful with it. Sometimes you can get a headache after a while. If you, like if you eat half the bag, remember they they are calories. And candy 60 and calories sugar. every, you know, three pieces. All right. I used the wild cherry ones for that. That really helped. Green apple. Green apple. Oh, it's kind of a sweet and sour kind of thing going mm -hmm. on there. And then we got cinnamon. That's good too. Yes, it is. And last hard candy of these kind of boxes, anyway, is good old fashioned peppermint. I always think of peppermint for Christmas, but yes. good any time. It is. All right, two more little boxes. Well, big boxes, actually. What is in here? Fragile handle with care. Just rip it open. What? Dr. Pepper Peeps? Of course. What? Gotta have some Dr. Pepper Peeps, man. Dr. Pepper Peeps. Amen. Amen. I like Dr. Pepper. Yeah, it's amazing. Uh, I find if you go to a place that only has Pepsi products, Dr. you usually can get a Dr. Pepper. Um, which is where we're going to go. Um, we're going to be in uh, Las Vegas. Las Vegas. So please let us know. Send us an email or contact us. Let us know and watch our live streams from the Market Week. Uh, we would love to meet up with you guys. And then um, ASD Market Week. They only. Uh, the reason why I brought it up is because they're Pepsi product only. Yep. In most of the places. What? What? Robin eggs. Robin eggs. I don't even know why I bought them like that. Because they're amazing. Okay. Well, now I know why I bought them. <laughs> so I can hug them. Heather wants to hug Robin eggs, so those are not Probably for sale. Probably for the bins. Or did you buy those for the church Easter egg hunt? It might have been the church Easter egg hunt. I can't okay. remember now. So it looks like we got Jelly Belly. What's this blue box, though? It looks different. It's fruity. E fruity. E fruity. Yeah. Yeah, totally just not down the scene. This is watermelon wedges. Watermelon wedges. Beautiful. All right, let's see what kind of jelly bellies we got. We're gonna just pull all these out. There. So much jelly belly goodness. This is how I unbox normally, just kind of lunatically. Mm -hmm. yeah, no rhyme or reason at nope. all. But we love you. All right. There we go. <gasps> Little Scotty dog. Oh, Scotty it? Dog's Red Licorice. That's perfect. This is a brand new kind. Yay. Yeah, I can't remember having that before. No. We might have, but... I think it's new. Now we have Scotty Dog's. Very cherry. Those are good. Those are really good. Black licorice. There's a lot of licorice in this sale. Yes. Video. Here's the regular butter popcorn. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Pancakes and maple syrup. Nice. I could eat pancakes. We should have that for supper. Oh, no, we should eat pancakes, man. We've got bacon. We can just do pancakes and bacon. There you go. Tropical mix. Nice. You know, we talk about food a lot on our videos. We do. Probably yeah. because we're always busy and we never, we eat like once a day. Yeah. More butter popcorn because that sells out like hotcakes. Not pancakes, but hotcakes. Mm. More very cherry because that sells out so fast. It does. And last but not least is our Snapple Mix. Nice. 
So that is our sweet unboxing after this sweet week. Definitely contact us if you plan on seeing us at ASD Market Week. Uh, watch the live streams. Hit that notification bell if you haven't already to make sure you get notified every time we do a live stream. Because Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, we're going to go live at kind of random times. We'll do our best to be probably around lunchtime, maybe. Try to, but... Lunchtime, give or take two hours. That's going to be... But remember, we're going to be on Vegas time. Uh, whatever time zone that is, and so just, we have no clue. Yeah, we don't. We don't know until we get. We don't there. know. Um, so just a, a reminder for that. And thanks so much for joining us for this unboxing. And of course, remember in the end, Jesus wins. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. If you'd like to watch more of my videos, just click on them here. And if you'd like to learn more about the reseller world, subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. Thanks.